I'm Jonathan Ayers with Network for Success, and today we're going to talk about what is the best laptop. Gosh, there's so many choices out there in the market, and you see commercials with PCs fighting against Macintoshes, and then you see other brands, Sony, and you know, there's Dell, and Toshiba, and Asus, and Acer, and gee, it just goes on and on and on. It's an alphabet soup, but really, when it comes down to what is the best laptop, for most people, your choices are going to be one of two choices in general based on the operating system. So one type of laptop is going to have the Windows operating system on it. And these would be what we call PC laptops. I've got one on my left here that's black sitting in front of us. And then the other one would be this white computer, which is a Macintosh operating system based computer. Now, the question comes around when you say, what is a, the best laptop? There would be a number of considerations. One would be money. But you know, in today's modern world, these two brands run neck and neck. You can buy them for pretty much the same cost for the same amount of features available. So why would you pick one over the other? Well, let me give you one very good reason to, and that is time wasting. PCs waste your time. And we've done a study in our business that showed that the average office can have a 33% increase in productivity by changing to Macintosh computers and laptops because they spend less time fooling around with trying to fix the laptop. Well, when I say that, most people shake their heads and go, what are you talking about? And then I want to explain to you that when you're running a PC and you're connected to the internet, you constantly have a threat and a problem of getting viruses, what we call malware, spyware, adware, and bots. Now, PCs get infested with these things, whereas Macintosh computers don't unless you as the operator approve them to come onto your computer. PCs are not sophisticated enough to know that, so they don't ask you first, whereas a Macintosh will. So you have a PC and you're on the internet for two or three days and then all of a sudden or weeks your computer starts to run slow and it's because you have what's called adware or spyware or malware that's come over the internet, lodged itself into your operating system and slowed it down. Well, then what do you have to do? You go out and you get these programs. They may cost you something. They may be for free. And you have to run the programs. It can take anywhere from three minutes to two hours to scour your laptop and find out why it's running slow and get rid of this adware and malware and spyware. Macintosh computers, you don't ever do that because it does not allow those programs to come onto your computer unless you approve it first. So I would say right off the bat that that one difference makes the Macintosh that much better and more productive a laptop would be my recommendation. 